Assalamualaikum friends. I am Adam Saibu, lecturer in mechanical department. Today we are going to see how to assemble the piston and connecting rod. It contains 14 parts. These are the parts. So these are all the parts we are going to assemble. We are going to draw the front and top here. In that first I am going to draw the cover this one is a cover <laughs> so before drawing draw to center line Now I am going to draw this line, this edge is 1.5 mm offset from the center line. So you mark 1.5 mm. And draw a line. <coughs> then I am going to draw this semicircle. This is of diameter 48. So the radius will be 24. Measure 24 in compass. Keep the compass at the intersection point of these two center line and draw a semicircle. You can draw it draw as a full circle. Next thing, I am going to draw this circle, this circle, semicircle. This is of radius 29. So measure 29 in compass with same center. Draw a semicircle. Then again, you can see another arc. This arc. The radius of this arc is not given in this diagram but in the cross section the cross section VB it has given that from this edge to this point the distance is 6.5 and this distance is 5 so this point indicates this arc and this point indicate this arc so the gap between these two arc is 1.5 mm so you just increase the radius by 1.5 that is 30.5 previous we have used 29 add 1.5 you will get 30.5 with the same center draw some circle then this distance was not given directly Before that, I am going to draw these two center line, which is of distance 60 mm. So from the middle, it will be 30, 30. So this distance will be 60 
Then <coughs> you can see here this is an arc of radius 10 mm so this distance will be 10 mm similarly this distance will also be 10 mm same diagram similar diagram so you will get this distance of 10 mm mark 10 mm here also 10 mm <clears throat> here this distance is given 3 mm and this distance 3 mm the total distance 22 mm and this to this distance is 20 mm so i'm marking 22 here 22 here i'm marking 20 from here 3 mm from this to this point is 3 mm and here also i'm marking the point of 3 mm distance Now, now I have to draw this line. This line will coincide over here. Here you can see this is a circle of diameter 10 point. Sorry. This is a circle of diameter 18. Then this radius will be 9. So this distance will get 9. So from the center, uh, center line, this distance will be 9 mm. For clarity, I'm using the sketch. Here you have to do your fillet. Next you can see here two dotted line. This is a hole of diameter 10.5. Two holes of diameter 10.5. So this distance will approximately equal to 5. Accurate is 5.25.
next thing i am going to draw this oil hole this oil hole is located this point is located at a distance 40 mm from this edge so from this edge i am marking 40 mm this height is 13.5 13.5 so this is the point so actually the oil hole center line is 30 degree inclination with the horizontal tilt your draft to 30 degree and draw the center line So this distance was given 10 mm. This distance was given 12 mm diameter. So from this point 6, this point 6. I have marked two point Here you can see a small curve here also. So this curve should connect these three points. I'm going to use Pro Circle. I am using a circle of diameter 22 mm to draw this arc. This oil hole is of size 3 mm diameter. From here I am marking 1.5, 1.5 and then 
from here three mm three mm total six so this this two distance is three mm this distance is six mm This oil hole should extend up to the bottom of the cover.